regular buses and special needs students, the driver or the driver and attendants, they walk to the back of the bus, make sure nothing, students didn't leave anything on the bus, but their job is to walk to the back of the bus and inspect it after their last student is dismissed. You come back to the facility and you leave the bus, you turn the bus off, and you try to walk out of the bus, this, it'll start, the horn will start sounding, the panic button will start harm. So you have to come back here and physically hit this for about three or four seconds and then it'll deactivate the alarm. But the whole idea is while you're walking back here, if there's a child on the bus, you see it. You notice the seats are higher on the buses than the old buses we used to have, so it's very important. And I, I really think about the time in 2005 is when we start getting the higher seats. So this was a feature that was added. What I would do is I would go to the back to check to see if we have any children in the seats or if anybody left anything in the seats, okay? And once I get all the way to the back and I don't see anything, if I forget to hit that button in the back, I would come back, just come back up. And if I attempt to go out this door without hitting the button in the back, that alarm goes off. Now here's the alarm back here. See that button? Do you know if the driver of this attendant checked this bus before leaving the bus? Evidently, that didn't happen.